Welcome back YouTube, we are here again back on Roblox. We're going to be playing a One Piece game and they got the new update. I haven't been able to make the video as quick as I'd like. I didn't get an OP fruit or an Operation fruit, whatever you want to call it. But I did do the raid a little bit and I found an easy way to do it, at least for some. And uh, you know, I like to find the easy way. I work smarter, not harder, you know what I mean? Um, I did drop the camera for now. Um, I had an issue with it, so I'm just going to leave it off for now. Let's do this raid. I'm going to show you how to do it easy. I heard a lot of people said, oh, I can't even make it to wave 20. Well, hopefully this will help. So, again, if there's any new codes, they'll be in the description below. And uh, without further ado, let's hop into it and play that intro. Alright guys, we're in here. We're going to do this. Um, this is the town you're going to need to be at. Um, it is called, I don't know how to say it, it's like a Luge, Logan Lug, Town. I've never really watched One Piece, so don't, you know, don't, don't hate on the pronunciation. But at the spawn, you can buy a little island tracker and it should point you right to the way. So, But yeah, once you're here, you come right over here. It's hard to miss because when you're anywhere near in the proximity of this place, you'll see this number floating through everything. You do not need four people to do it. We can just go in and I'm going to do it myself. And honestly, I do this. I grind this. Um, I've had no luck getting any good drops, but I do solo it pretty easily. And it don't even take that long. Obviously, these are my stats, you know, right here. So if you're below that, it just will take longer. But depending on your fruit, you can do this. Not every fruit can handle this. Uh, I do think you're going to need... Yeah, you can get bow up there, so you don't need to fly per se. You just need range. If you don't have range, then this video is probably not for you. This isn't uh, easy mode for everyone, but it's easy mode for most. I recommend light. Um, definitely. Let me put these away. I do have a lot of fruits. Be sure to subscribe and comment on the videos, and I will pick random people to, uh, to win from free fruits. And I also do tons of giveaways in the Discord, so... I mean, I have a, a whole giveaway channel in there. So if you want some free fruits, that's the way to do it. So in the beginning, I did, I'm just going to start out, I, you know, smacking these guys. They're pretty easy. It isn't until about wave 20 that I even need to move. For you, it could be different. When when things start to get scary and you get, you know, anxiety and it's a little hard, that's when you're going to go where you go. This was harder when it first came out because you couldn't see where they were. But now they added this. Super nice. So... I mean, realistically, there ain't much to this. I just kind of keep killing them as they come. And eventually, yeah, see, now they take two hits. And eventually, they'll take three or four. And then next thing you know, I got to actually use my whatever. I don't even know how to say that, but my, like, rapid fire. And just like that, they're already needing a little extra. But it's moving quite quick. We're on wave six so far. Um, there are tons of fruits that will work for this. But I can only vouch for what I've used. So I will always highly recommend using light as you can see I mean it's just a cakewalk with light it's super easy if you have light I can guarantee you're gonna be able to do this no problem like no problem and it's even better because you have three lives so even if you're smaller and you screw up and you get killed yeah you get a redo and then a redo of a redo I shoot them as much as I can until they get to me sometimes I'll run a little bit so I can get another shot off sometimes I'll jump up hit them with my other shot and then do this one but at the end once I start doing R and this rapid fire, it's it's a done deal. It's over. There ain't much that lives through that. Only the bosses can live through that. So that's all I'm going to do. So I'm going to skip to, I'd say, about wave 19, wave 20-ish. And that's when things have changed. Because this is what you see right now. That's all I do for the next, you know, 10 waves or so. Actually, I'll just fast forward it. Let's, uh, oh, let's speed through. Ignore that. Just pop it in for a moment to pause and let you know, you know, 90% of the people are not subscribed to my channel. That's insane. Even if half of you did, like, oh my God, I blow up. If I, if my views match my subs, oh, all you got to do is hit that button to change that for me. You literally could change my life with one single click. So come on guys, hit it up. 
I do my best for you, do your best for me. All right, back to it. So we're getting to where we want to be and I just just want to also point out even if you don't have You know light or you're not as strong and it takes you longer There's other options like they're slow, especially in the first 20 waves well 19 or so You can just do this all day. You know, what I mean you don't have to do what I do You can just run around hit run around hit. It's just a matter of how uh, how much determination you got in uh, how patient Because really it's not that hard. I mean look at this but once you get to wave, I think it's 20, that's when stuff starts to get a little tricky. And that's when the range fruit's going to come in. There's other ways you could do it. You could run, blast them, heal. Uh, oh, what? Yeah, that's what happens when you're not careful. All right, well, this is a good time to put my stuff back on. Anyways, like I was saying, yeah, it gets hard after wave 20, but uh, you have to be able to get up to there. That's where, I'm, where we're going to go. All right, so that oh, are they dead? Okay, so wave 19. I think wave 20 is the dangerous one. We'll see. And as you can see, they are crazy strong already. And my defense is like almost 1700. Like, that's insane. Oh, this is where it's gonna get dangerous. Oh, yep. See, so for me, I'm just gonna fly. There's a particular spot I like. If you come right over here to the dock where the boats are. See this like uh, arch? I like the this one right here. That's right up here. Sometimes they will try to hit you, so you might want to go a little higher. But pretty much all I do is I wait from the group up, or sometimes I don't. If you have light, you don't have to wait, or certain other ones. But the range is ridiculous. See, boom. I'm just gonna spam them. They have a lot of life, and I just kind of gapo up here. And it's you know I like to cheese these. Uh, again, I said work. You know. Work smarter, not harder. You know that whole the whole thing. Why would I go down there where I could die instead when I could stay up here and not die, and it'd, it'd be quicker? I just sit here and blast until it's over. All right, got that one dead. So that was the boss. So now they're gonna be shooting guns at you. This is where it gets a little dangerous. They didn't do it. They only do it in the beginning. Like they'll still try to hit you up here. Sometimes you're unlucky and they still get a hit on you like that. So you may want to stay up higher in the beginning of this. But you pretty much, ow. Once you start, it, I don't know, it doesn't seem to keep happening. They have very short life in this. And there they go. So we're just going to rinse and rip. Oh, if you ever fall, you can always fly if you have a fly skill. Oh, they're right underneath. But for the most part, it's just get up, up here and blast. Alright, so we're on wave 24. Oh, wow. They don't normally hit me like that. That's crazy. Again, like I said... Um, you can always go a little higher if, if, if you can't take any hits at all. Um, yeah, this would probably still work because, like, the range on, uh, like, especially if you have light fruit. If you have light, you can definitely go higher. I've literally sh shot somebody who was at the, that luge or log. I, I don't know how to say it. That town that I was at when this, where this is. I hit somebody that was there from the wilderness. The whole other island. All the way over there. So, yes, you could go much higher and stay safe and get out of their range. And still be able to blast the heck out of them. See, like when they're about to spawn, sometimes they'll stay up higher. And then if I feel comfortable, I'll go down and start shooting. You just gotta play with it, find out how it fits for you. It's a little different for uh, each person. It depends on your size, depends on your fruit, depends on your computer, if it lags during this. There's all kinds of factors. But this is how I do it, and as you can see, I'm not really struggling. Doesn't really take that long either. They die pretty quickly. All right, so we're on wave 29, and like I said, this is pretty easy. Um, hopefully, this works for you. I get if you're like brand brand new and you like stuff like that, it may not work. Um, that's up to you to try and figure out. I mean, any, almost anybody can like you know gepo, so you can get up here. It's just a matter of if you have the range, how long it'd take you to kill them, that sort of deal. But this method is. For the most part, foolproof, and it can work for almost anybody as long as you got some range. 
Uh, we're on wave 30 right now. All right, we're about to end this. And then once it ends, it, you'll see it appear on your bar. But then it might take me a minute because this is the boss here. And I just Geppo up above him. He can't reach me up here, so... Sometimes I screw up with the Geppo and I fall a little bit and I can be in danger. But for the most part, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I got too uh, crazy with spamming the moves. That's all that was. Oh, he died. I got a lightning fruit. Blah. And a mill. Well, there you have it, guys. That is how to easily beat Laws Raid or whatever they're calling it. I've already claimed this, so go away. Get off my screen. Well, hopefully this helped, guys. I mean, now you have another way to farm fruits, you know, or whatever else drops from that. And hopefully you can do it a lot easier now because I've seen a lot of people I've talked to. They're like, whoa, how are you soloing? And I die. I can't even make it past wave 20. Well, don't try to fight it right. Fight it smart. <laughs> stay up high. Stay out of range the best you can. And just rain down from above and destroy them. Um, let me know in the comments if this helped you at all. And if it did, like, share, comment, subscribe. It helps us a lot. One little click will change it all for us. And you can do that. Help us out. Uh, join the Roblox group, tons of cool people, cool merch, and more. Hop in the Discord if you want to chat with us or you have any ideas or suggestions. You know the whole spiel. But that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Alpha Misfits is out.